Hello everyone, so this is Apurva from Unique Handicrafts. Today, uh, this is a simple video uh, regarding how to assemble your painted terracotta beads. So this is just, um, uh, I've, you can see here, uh, the assembling, I've not still done the assembling of my necklace, but I've just arranged in a pattern the way I'm going to assemble it through my necklace wire. So let's start with it. So whenever you're assembling your necklace, you have to start, just make sure you start from the end point, okay? And one more thing, uh, with this necklace, you can see, I've used other beads also. So the white bead you can see here, this is a uh, normal per, uh, pearl bead. This is not a terracotta one. Uh, and the normal small pearl beads are also there, the white color ones here, which I'm showing. Then there are some transparent beads, okay? And just, just to enhance the design of my necklace. And other is uh, other is a dark green bead. I had, uh, so I thought maybe this, this is just going with the necklace set. So I just added it over here. And here you can see, as a pendant pattern, I have just used um, a feather kind of, uh, you know, uh, this is a, I had I had actually made this feather design uh, this was not a pendant but just a design made by me and I thought maybe this can go with this particular necklace so let's start with uh, the assembling of the necklace now in this so so first of all you have to start with the uh, wire that is the necklace wire this is this is the this you can get uh, in market anywhere in the jewelry shop so this is the necklace wire okay uh, just take the ends of it Okay, so just take the ends of it, uh, take the first bead, take the first bead and put it inside, right? Similarly, take the second bead and put it inside. The third one, the third one, this one is the terracotta one, the blue colored one. Then uh, accordingly, in the series you have arranged. Uh, what is the use of the arrangement, you know, assembling this kind of, so it becomes very easy for you to uh, directly pick it up from the line and put it up, put it into the necklace wire, okay. Otherwise, it would be very difficult for you all to manage uh, and it will, it will not be matched from both the sides. If you don't do this way, uh, then your necklace will not be matched. It would be matched, but then with a lot of efforts. Okay, so I'm just putting it. Uh, this is my lantern bead, okay, this is the design. You all can uh, check the making, the coloring of this bead on my YouTube channel. How to color this bead and how to make this bead. Okay. I'm just simply picking the pearls, the beads from my arranged assembly and using it over here. I mean, uh, putting it into my necklace. So this makes your assembling really easy if you have a little extra beads. Okay. So this is what you can see. I have used it. Okay, it looks like that. Now comes the pendant, the feather pendant. So I'm just taking and putting it inside it. See what is uh, what is the advantage of this thing? Huh? Assembling. Okay, so you can see the pendant here. Yeah. Now I'll start from the other side. Uh, other side. One side of the necklace is done. I'm doing it for the other side now. So you can see. Okay, then the pearl bead. Okay, see they are symmetrical now from both the sides. Now after pearl bead goes your bird bead. This is the bird bead. Then after that goes the pearl one, the you know, these beads actually, uh, apart from terracotta, which I'm using, no, it really enhances the design of your necklace. It's This is this is something which uh, a modern combination, we can say, to our traditional jewellery. Because terracotta is actually the traditional method, you know, traditional jewellery making method, which is uh, followed in India. So, yeah, this is what it looks like. Then, uh, after this, I'll be putting uh, the other bead. See, this assembling is also a step. This and this is this also should be done very properly and peculiar. 
so yeah you can see okay uh, now I'm just completing my work just two to three beads are pending so I'll just put them uh, after this is this one the blue bead and uh, after that is the you know this the purple purple one and then the green bead okay you can see and after green there's uh, again a uh, no actually okay so this is the green no the green is the small bead actually yeah this is the small bead the last bead of the necklace and then there goes the green one i'll be showing you and the last is the pearl one okay so here is the assembling of my necklace okay if you want you can use this pendant so i'll just hold it for you this is a little bit heavier because there are different kind of uh, beads i've been using here you know so this necklace is a little bit heavier and just pull the you now necklace thread from both the ends to make it equal okay so you can see i've assembled my cherry kota necklace yeah. this is what it looks like okay now uh, these are the ends make sure that you have equal length for uh, on both the end this way make sure you have equal length on these ends okay and then simply tie one side so uh, this side we will try tie you just make a knot okay so here goes the necklace last look for you all uh, holding it this way would be better okay so yeah it's done if you like my video if you like this i'll be uh, i'll be coming with more of the necklace ideas and designs if you like this uh, please share and subscribe to my channel unique handicrafts by apurva thank you thanks a lot